Hi everyone again, it's Mr. Mether and I'm outside once again in my yard and today we're going to do another measurement activity but this time it's going to be measuring triangles and working out the perimeter. So in my bucket I've got some handy dandy equipment that I've set up. So I've got my form to mark off. So we have a look here, I've got my shots, one, two, three, four, five. You can do, I'll go like this, you can do more shots if you want to and then I've got the spots to add my three measurements because triangles have three sides one two three and this is a spot over here for my perimeter okay i want you to try and set up something like this to submit because there'll be a prize involved next in my handy end bucket is this stick now this stick's made of metal and i'll show you why in a minute stick that into the ground i've got my tape measure to do my measuring put that in my pocket and what you've got and i've got are these three blue balls so everyone's got a set of these balls and it's for this activity and another one as well okay put my bucket over here this is what you need to do in this task i'm going to find a spot and we're going to measure five meters this time so last time it was 10 this time it's five so i'll put my balls into the bucket and i'm going to measure from my stick that i just stuck in the ground five meters Okay, my stick's in the ground down there, and this time I'm gonna try and throw from here, where the tripod is, out there, so about five meters. This time, I'm gonna use the three balls. That will create our corners of the triangle, and then we're gonna measure the distance from each corner, and then work out the perimeter. Okay, here we go, three balls. One, two, three there's our three balls let's go and do the measuring so here i am one two three now the bonus of having this stick here is that it's magnetic so on my tape measure it has a little magnet on the end so if i put that there i can measure across and show the perimeter or the distance between this one and this one, then this one and that one, and then back again. All right, so here we go. First distance. I'm gonna go 79. 79 centimeters. Okay, let's As measure the See, It's magnetized onto there, comes along. And the next measurement is 197. Over to my paper, side two, 197 centimeters. The next one, I had to move my metal rod. It's magnetized. Notice I'm measuring from behind the ball. And the measurement for this one is 176. 176. We are, I've written out our numbers, 79, 197, and 176. So nine plus seven is 16, plus another six is 22. Put down the two, carry the two. Two plus seven is nine, plus nine is 18, plus seven is 25. Put down the five, carry the two, and then two plus one is three, plus one is four, giving us a measurement of 452 centimeters for the perimeter of our triangle. So the challenge for this competition is to measure the perimeter of the triangle, but to win the trophy this week, what you have to do is give me, throwing the balls from a distance of five meters away, a triangle with the smallest perimeter. So we're looking for something like that. Now the balls are not allowed to be touching. So if they're touching, you have to re-throw one of them. Okay, and you're gonna give me the smallest perimeter. Now you can do as many as you want. Maybe not as many as say 20, don't go over 20. Okay, 
and you need to submit those to the link in the learning task, which will then go into my spreadsheet and I'll be able to work out who has the smallest perimeter triangle. All right, now just because I can, I'm gonna do a drone shot of the next triangle that I do, just to show how we measure the perimeter. Here we go. One, two, three. Release the drone. There we go. I've measured my second triangle, drone assisted, um, and got my triangle, and it was a bit bigger that time. So I'll keep measuring, get my smallest one, and submit it on compass. All right, now it's your go. See you later.